She shot you in the chest, and you still think she's innocent? No, she shot me in the chest, and now I know she's innocent. Thank you. Don't you see, just like that vest protected me, Emma's adoption papers, they're protecting the killer. You know that made no sense, right? I, I, I think what Castle is suggesting is that one of Emma's birth parents may be behind all of this. That's why Angela took those records, to find her birth parents. What if you found one of them? Perhaps living on Overlook Road in Scarsdale. But what if that birth parent didn't want to be found? What if Emma learning the truth was a threat somehow? Castle, that's just speculation. And if you're right, we'll probably never know. The killer's most likely destroyed the records by now. Unless Angelo hid them. I mean, they were supposed to be a surprise. Head back to Angelo's place. We need to search it again. You are aware that you don't actually work here anymore, right? I'm sorry. Old habits. Oh, good. I will grab Sully. Go check again, just in case. But not because you asked me to, because I actually own my way. OK, so let's suppose it is one of Emma's birth parents. If Angelo's murder was a setup, then how would they know how to stage it? I mean, they gave her up for adoption, so how would they know about Emma's violent history? Newspaper articles. No, I checked. Because she was a minor, her name was withheld. So then our killer had to have had access to Emma's sealed juvie records. And for that, you need a subpoena. Looks like someone skipped that step. Emma's sealed records were opened three days ago. By who? 